Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when controller is not working with Tekken 8 game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to restart the game. So if the game is running, close the game and then launch the game once again and then check. Next step is to disable the Steam input. Now for this, if the game is open, close the game, then make a right click of the game on Steam, then select properties. Now go to the controller tab and over here you will see the option which says disable steam input you can select this and now you can launch the game and then check if that does not work you can even try enable steam input and then check for many user disabling steam input has worked so you can try this if that does not work you can try enable steam input now the next step is to now this is for playstation controller users you can try using ds4 windows or rewsd application now this has worked for many players so it might work for you so you can use this application that is ds4 windows or rewasd and then check next step is to disable steam input first of all uh, go to steam make a right click on the game select properties and then go to the controller tab and then over here disable steam input and once you disable it now you can go to steam and then go to settings and then go to the controller tab now over here if you have Xbox controller, then uh, make sure that you turn it on, which says enable Steam input for Xbox controller. And then you can check. Now, if you have PlayStation controller, in that case, you can enable PlayStation controller support. And then check. Now, still the controller is not working, then you can always reverse the action. You can always... Uh, default the settings now the next step is to now for many users using x input emulator has worked so you can try this and uh, this has worked for many players so it might work for you now the next step is to make sure to keep on your controller with x input config screen in the settings of the game uh, to check if they are set to your preference so you can try this you can go to the game and then you can go to options go to the options and then uh, and then you can go to controller setup and then check over here and then you can go back and then go to button mapping and you can go to controller setup x input controller and check everything is correct over here so you can make changes over here and then you can confirm and exit and then now the next step is to make sure to disconnect other peripherals as mouse and keyboard so if you can disconnect mouse and keyboard you can but if you want to connect it again you can always connect it also if you have additional controller connected disconnect it sometimes you have additional controller connected so if you have it disconnect it also if you have any kind of usb adapter which you are not using disconnect it now if you are using any kind of virtual controller you can disable it or uninstall it and then relaunch the game and then check next step is to launch the steam in big picture mode and then launch the game so on the steam on the top right here you can see big picture mode icon click on it now once the steam is in big picture mode you can go to the game and launch the game and then check if that does not work you can again go to menu and then go to um, sorry uh, click on the game and then over here you can see the manage option click on manage then go to properties and then go to controller and try both you can disable steam input and then check if that does not work you can enable steam input and then check and then relaunch the game now the next step is to the last step is to use wired controller so if nothing is working you can use a wired connection and that should help you to get the controller working with the game. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.